Margarita Sweet Potato Vine at Roplands.org, also known as the Ipoema Batata. Uh, so this is uh, like as any other sweet potato. It's edi- the leaves are edible. Uh, mostly, it's not grow uh, for the edible uh, uh, reason. It's mostly grow for the leaves. It's a great ground color. Uh, grow uh, in a variety of uh, soil. It's super easy to grow from full sun to uh, to half shade. Uh, there isn't special requirement. Uh, hardiness zone will be uh, 10 above, uh, but can grow also as annual plant. Uh, water will be average. Uh, some, if you have really hot summer, so be aware that sometimes can cause uh, some problem in the mid uh, of the day that it's super hot. Uh, there is tubers that you can eat, but they are very small and it's not really grow for this kind of reason. I don't know about the, the flavor of this uh, kind of uh, tubers, but uh, again, it's not for it. You can eat the leaves. The leaves can use for uh, in order to cook it with rice, to cook it with uh, uh, I don't know with eggs. You can put maybe stir fry, uh, rolled leaves. Um, I'm not a chef for sure, and also for salad, but I am not recommend, there is too much uh, chewy a little bit and very strong, maybe the young leaf you can try for salad, it's possible, but I am not recommend. Uh, so it's mostly, as I said before, it's grow for the leaves itself, and you can grow it as a ground cover whipping, it can whip, or even edge plant if you have a wall, it can cover the wall. Uh, if you grow it as a perennial, uh, you should uh, once in a while uh, check, cut a little bit uh, the old vines and just to put a new one. Uh, the best way to start is by uh, plants, of course, to buy or cuttings. You put the cutting, uh, the stems in the water, or you can put it in the, directly in the soil. I prefer in the water; it's uh, faster and you can uh, follow the roots, uh, so it's nicer. Uh, don't let it grow too much in the water. After this, it starts to be rotten. And switch every two days, or even the best, it will be every one every day to switch the water. Uh, the leaves uh, are mostly green, yellowish. And as you can see, the shape is uh, quite of, uh, beautiful. Uh, that's all from growplants.org. Don't forget to subscribe, visit our website, and of course, like this video. Ah, just one last thing about the blooming. Apparently, this is uh, one bloom, probably, uh, if you don't uh, grow it as a perennial. Uh, that's all. Hope you enjoy.